Hi, it's Alex from One to Call here, and in this video, we're going to look at using security cameras to detect body temperature. So what we're talking about here is Hikvision's range of thermal detection cameras. This is a range of turret cameras of varying resolution and a complementary handheld device. So what are the claims? Hikvision are claiming for this camera to be able to detect the temperature of the human body with an accuracy of plus or minus 0 0.5 degrees Celsius in normal usage, just using the camera. The tolerance can be as low as 0 0.3 degrees Celsius with the additional black body unit. This is a unit that calibrates the infrared camera that's used for higher accuracy. Um, and, it, and it also claims it can be used with accuracy up to a distance of 1.5 meters for reduced exposure to the individuals using it. So what kind of uses? Well, obviously at the minute, Hikvision are promoting these cameras as fever detection units for obvious reasons. Uh, they're clearly aimed at COVID-19 prevention, but can they actually help? Well, the average adult body temperature is between 36.1 and 37.2 degrees Celsius. And the COVID-19 guidance says that um, you should uh, isolate yourself when you temp if you've got a persistent temperature of above 37.8 degrees or higher. So a 0.6 degree of difference. And if you remember the tolerance was supposed to be 0 0.5 degrees. So in theory, it could be used um, to detect whether people's increased uh, body temperature suggests they may have some kind of fever. And alerts and alarms can be set so that when people pass the camera, if it detects a higher temperature, that um, there can be uh, alerts sent by email or an audio or, visu audio or visual alert to let people around know. Obviously, they're pushing this as something to be able to monitor and identify people requiring additional checks when you do a proper medical check. Uh, but it may be worth considering on an ongoing basis. I mean, it's good practice to try and stop any kind of flu or fever from spreading not just within the population, but within your workforce. Thinking of uh, non-body uses for them, I'd encourage people to think about the general uses for this technology. Obviously, it could be used as a high temperature alarm. So anything that's going above the core temperature is meant to operate at. Even, for instance, um, detecting fire within a room before a smoke alarm even alerts you. Um, think about monitoring over overheating parts in a factory, on a factory line, a production line. Uh, monitoring server rooms, for instance. Um, the temperature that your IT equipment gets to can be very critical as to its operational efficiency. Things like policing non-smoking areas. Um, and obviously, one camera can be used to monitor a large area. So instead of needing lots of individual temperature sensors, you can monitor a large area. Think, for instance, for usage in food, such as food on a supermarket shelf in a refrigerator <clears throat> or on a hot buffet counter where temperatures have to be consistent. Um, and also, obviously, um, the turret cameras that we're talking about here, they're dual lens. They have a normal camera and they have the infrared camera. So they can be used as regular cameras as well, but with the additional temperature sensors as a bonus. So, can I get hold of them? Well, Hikvision have increased the production and our distributors in the UK are holding extra extra stock because they're expecting there to be a lot of demand for these cameras. Um, if you think about the fact that you can integrate these into your existing Hikvision solution or you can operate them as a standalone system, um, then it can work across a lot of uses as we've just talked about. So, um, if you're interested in more details or discussing how you might uh, use these in practice, um, how to set them up uh, for their most accurate usage, um, and just anything in general um, about adopting these um, thermal detection cameras, then get in contact with us. Paul's our security specialist and a Hikvision expert. You can contact him using the details on screen now. Um, and please subscribe to the channel for, for any future updates and follow us on social media uh, we're usually at Once Call UK. Thanks for watching.